Some of my previous videos have put me in a good mood. Who knew that putting nice things on the internet would feel so good? You'd think more people would start doing it. I'd like to do another nice review before I remember that E4 still exists. Oh, shit. Anyway, Hustle. The BBC drama about con artists Robin Hooding their way around London, using complicated tricks and schemes to take thousands of pounds from rich assholes. The reason I'm reviewing the first three series of Hustle is because these series all have exactly the same five hustlers, and Robin Hooding is exactly the right verb. And yes, that is a real verb. They all heavily emphasise that you can't cheat an honest man, which means they take a great care in making every rich businessman, and it is always a rich businessman, look like a massive, unpleasant, money-grabbing thug. So much so that you will end up rooting for the hustlers, even though they do frequently break their own rules when they start roaming the streets of London, nicking from everyone they see. But somehow watching this you will still be impressed or amused by each of the characters. They all have interesting and believable backstories, but despite this, the main driving point is the story. Each contains a long con. Each one is massively complicated. To complicate things further, the audience gets a strange outsider's perspective on the whole thing. Rather than see every meticulously planned step, we see chunks of ideas that seem to be strung together through good fortune. It isn't until the very end that we find out that it wasn't luck at all. We just didn't see every part of the plan. Every episode follows this basic storyline, except for a few that keep things from us that we didn't even know were missing. They tend to have you believing that they were conning someone, but actually conning someone else. All this being said, it's surprising that they can remove key plot points from the story and still keep the narrative coherent, but they manage it and manage it well. In all my videos, that's the most reviewery thing I've ever written, so I will balance it out by saying the phrase wanky tosspot. But there are two rather large problems that hover over these series like pigeons ready to do squirty dumps all over our heads. I'm sensing another E4 metaphor. Problem one. Rather than treating these cons like some kind of job, the hustlers seem to consider themselves artists. At least once an episode they proudly spurt some cliché bollocks about their chosen profession. I think it's easy to cope with, though. It seems like it's done with a sense of irony. Like the bit where Mickey gives Danny about five different first rules. Problem two is probably the only actual problem with the show. Where the fuck does all their money go every episode? At the start of pretty much every episode, they say, We haven't got any money. Why not hustle? I'm not going to tell you. Every episode they make at least £50,000, and yet they start the next episode with nothing. I like to imagine that they get it hustled away from them by a vastly superior crew. But that's all we can really do. Imagine, because it sure as hell doesn't tell us. However, when all is said and done, Hustle is a great show. Its flaws are easily overlooked, given that if you close your eyes and pick any of the first 18 episodes at random, it will be entertaining and interesting, and altogether well written. Thanks for listening. Here's the email address if you want to send me any show ideas.